No, your eyes are not deceiving you. That really is a flying car. A US startup recently released this footage of an ultralight pre-production version of its vehicle. It is actually looks like and functions as the regular car. You can drive most of the way, take off and fly without transition over some kind of a traffic, over an obstacle, over uh, a river, over anything, and then continue driving. Or you can fly all the way in the transition in the biplane mode. You as a driver have a choice of that. It's hard to tell from the videos if the test flight was manned. When one US broadcaster filmed a demo flight, its reporting team was kept at a distance and didn't see if anyone entered or left the cockpit. But the company says there was a pilot inside in the films it's released, and its CEO is bullish that the vehicle's engineering is sound. The safety of the uh, actual vehicle is good enough for consumers. You need to understand the rules of airspace. It comes naturally to you, but there are rules of how you operate on the ground. There are also rules of how you operate in the air. The company isn't revealing much in a bid to protect its intellectual property. And we also didn't get to see the car perform some of the more complex maneuvers it needs for efficient flight. We need to make sure it's safe to operate. We are working as hard as possible to try to get it to customers. We plan to start the production of the first one in about a year, either by the end of 25 or beginning 26. This is not the only player in the market. There's competition from much more developed playing car hybrids. And of course, in much of the world, flying is tightly controlled. If you want to mix it with air traffic, you'll need more than just a driving license.